What's up everyone, welcome to the fifth attempt at Breaking 50. I was not able to uh, record an intro into this, it didn't sound great, so we're kind of doing this voiceover deal. We're back here in Alice trying to do our best to break 50. So it had been a few weeks since I had played, so I was looking excited to get back on the course. This driver here went a little to the left, didn't put me in a horrible spot. I was able to get a decent look at the hole. Um, the short game you'll see <laughs> Coming up will be a struggle throughout the day, so put myself back in the fairway and then, um, you know, really try to get a decent shot in. And as you can see, I was not super happy with it because it went over. Um, the next shot up, really uh, lucky that it didn't get too far there. Uh, kind of you know, hit behind the ball pretty heavily, but at least it got me on the green and gave me a putt. Um, they had just punched these greens, so they're redoing the greens at the local muni, so I know they look a little bit sandy, but um, I think in, during the season they're going to be great. So, had a decent roll, pretty close, uh, couldn't ask for, you know, a, a better putt there. Left me with a little tap in, so I was able to knock that in, and then move on to the next hole. Uh, here I was really into win, I probably should have clubbed up because it left me way short. Um, as you can see, kind of my shirt moving there. Uh, so I was able to get the next shot. Really went high in the air, which again affected it because the wind was going straight in. But as you can see, the flag there. So it, it really just kind of went nowhere. Uh, I did get on the green though, so it gave me opportunity to get some putts in um, in order to try to make a decent uh, score here. It is a par three. So I was hoping to maybe, if possible, make this long one for par, which I did not i uh, got super close there though so another little tap in uh, for a bogey this hole has always been my grip tonight when it comes to driving for some reason i will always go wide right i usually go wide right but i usually can compensate for it a certain amount i was left when this kind of weird lie here in the trees um, i could either punch out and play it easy or i could go into this little circle right there a little space in between those trees right there to try to get a, uh, a shot in so I was going to keep it low and try to go all the way through um, as you can see that small little gap there so I went through most of the trees I hit the very last one I got lucky though because the ball actually bounced into the fairway so it left me a decent you know chip in up into the green um, again the short game as you can see the counter in the bottom was a struggle on this day so that uh, chip right there did not go well I did leave it short, so I went ahead and did another one here. Um, was pretty happy with that one. Got some air onto it. Was able to stop a decent amount close to the green, and then uh, give me a little putt uh, to finish the hole off. Next hole here has pretty wide uh, fairway. I was actually able to get it right uh, through the middle of the fairway, which was exciting. I won a few times today. Uh, hit this three wood to try to get me. A little closer to the hole and actually put me to the right uh, so I was able to get this chip up um, I hit it as you can see it kind of topped it a little bit and hit it over the green ended up near this uh, hog trap so I bumped it into the hill to where it just landed on the green I didn't want to go back over uh, left myself a putt in order to get a little closer I knew thinking it was going to be a long shot so I just needed a decent putt in order to be able to two putt from there left myself a decent putt here in order to finish off the hole uh, move on to the next another hole with a decent drive uh, stayed a little bit to the right of the fairway uh, kind of in the trees a bit but nothing too crazy left myself a little opening here in order to get to the hole I did top this one again uh, so left it to the left of the hole so I had to dip up from you know just right off the green uh, didn't work out as well because as you can tell here in my reaction I hit it over and I was kind of getting a little frustrated with the short game as you can see the counter on it, it's going a little crazy um, so had another chip just tried to get it on the green get the putter in my hand try to you know just get the putting had a decent uh, lift on that one it stayed on the green so I was at least decently happy about that uh, another putt in order to finish with this one off I got close again left a little bit short um, so I had another tap in here in order to finish this hole off and move on to the next one as you can see the short game counter really 
uh, climbing up and we need to work on that next hole uh, also, also another decent driving hole left myself a decent uh, lie here as well um, always just looking to stay you know close to the fairway took this three way too far left I actually ended up on the tee box over on the next hole on the left side uh, so I had this shot here to get over this tree and onto the green luckily I was able to use a little bit of touch and get it on the green um, it did roll off to the right so it stayed on the green but it left me a pretty far putt as far as I'm hoping uh, so at here I'm hoping to two putt get it up close and then uh, try to tap it in left it quite a bit short um, shorter than I was expecting so I have this extended putt here to try to close this hole out which didn't work out but it left them, led to my first three putt of the day which is not super happy about it but at least I went this many holes without uh, having a three putt onto my favorite hole here at the Muni you have to get over this water a little part three I uh, took a decent stroke here uh, landed a little right of the green so I had a chip up here um, as they always say as every golfer says I would have had the right angle I would have had a decent decent shot here um, put it up on the green uh, which I was happy that it only took one chip to do had a decent putt um, I was hoping it was gonna go in and again got super close but missed it but had to tap it Again, I'm fully aware that my short game needs to improve if I want to get better because as you can see right there, I missed that putt from very, very close. So I'm going to go ahead and tap it in here, but work to be done there. Next hole, another decent drive here. Uh, driver is getting a little more, more comfortable, at least putting it in a spot where I'm not way completely off to the right. Um, and I'm decent within the fairway or at least a little slightly off, you know, the first cut, second cut there in the fairway uh, as far as that goes. Um, had myself a decent shot here. As you can see, I took a lot of <laughs> dirt there, so that did not work out the way I wanted to. Um, and then things were just falling apart as here, as you can tell. Um, I had this chip up. I hit it a little too high, hit the tree, came right back down. Uh, was, was starting to lose it. I hit it again, hit the tree again, came right back down. And I'm just trying to figure out what's wrong with the tree. Why does it keep getting in my way? Just trying to discuss it. Um, I had another chip and of course, uh, true fashion, went way left on it. Uh, the wheels are really starting to fall off here. So um, I dumped this chip and I'm like, oh my goodness, what am I doing? Why is my short game so bad this, to this, this event? So, did this one, uh, at least I got it on the green. I'd had enough of this club, so I put it down softly, picked up my putter, and went on with my life. <laughs> Hit a putter, a putt here, trying to get close to it, and uh, decently close, but again, break, the, uh, break there at the last minute, and left me with a little uh, finishing putt here in order to move away from this hole. I wanted to run from this hole. I was so done with it. After the blow up on that hole, I knew that I could not break 50, but I wanted to get as close to it as possible. So I hit again, decent drive here, left me in the fairway. I had a decent look in. Um, my goal was to get this, this club here onto the green and I duffed it. I think I just put too much pressure on me to get on there. Um, duffed it short, uh, left myself a pretty difficult shot here. Uh, again, trying to get over the tree and into the uh, and closer to the green, tried to, to go low, uh, decided to go past the green here, uh, had one chip up um, to try to put it on the green in order to get the putter in the hand in order to stop chipping for the day because I was over it. Um, to, had this putt, was decently close, a little to the right, um, but it did leave me a second putt that was uh, fairly short, I was able to finish the round off. That was a 52. Uh, sadly, we did not break 50 today. Uh, it's very obvious that my short game is, is struggling. I'm happy the way I hit everything else, uh, as far as driver and long iron and stuff goes. Only missed by a couple of strokes as bad as I played, so I'll take it for what it is and keep working on it.
you guys next time.